Cheers, people. It's the Kid Daytona, and I'm here lounging, literally, with Report Magazine. Yeah. It's the things you do that makes me fall in love with you. But I won't stop myself just to fall in love with you. It's the things you do Yo, that the Kid Daytona. Shout out Bronx MC and all that and all. Uh, Right now we are currently on the Summer Games tour. And where does Summer Games come from? You know what I'm saying? It's kind of like a lifestyle out there that I came up with. Um, I had this trip to Europe and it just like inspired a lot of thoughts in my mind. And, you know, the fact that the Olympics was going to be there. And just everything that we were doing. It just like influenced a lot of things. Like just my whole vibe and music and just a lot of things. So we just decided to call the project Singing Games. Wrapping that up right now, be out to you, over 20. Yeah. Places I rest my head, some led to relations I kept. Love a lot. You know, the only features, there's only two features right now on there. Um, that's Jada Kiss and uh, Raheem Devon. And really, I just wanted to showcase myself on this, you know, just more so even because it's a lot of my. Uh, my experiences, you know what I mean, and I'm just talking about a lot of experiences, a lot of stories, you know, just off the, the month that I was there, it just gave me so much things to write about, so, you know, doing, I ain't really want to have them people in there, just talking about them. Um, Harry Fraud, produce on there, um, I got a lot of new cats on there, uh, this cat from out of Toronto named Bird and Keys, um, I work with some legends on there, Knife Wonders on there, Bink is on there. Uh, Rockwaller is on there. Um, yeah, man, and, and it's definitely like an L project, dog. Like, there's definitely some new things that you're gonna hear from me on there as well. Like a lot of up tempos, you know, a lot of different flows and all that. And um, I feel like to me, it's like my most complete work to date. Right now, I just feel like I still got a lot to prove. And that's like where my mind is at. Um, day to day I see, like I, I check the tweets and I search my name and I'm like, seeing this more and more people like, yo, kid they tone this nice, yo, they sleeping on them. You know, I don't understand why people don't match with they tone it. For me, you know, with this music industry, a lot of people don't know what goes on really behind the scenes, you know. And definitely you hear politics, politics, but a lot of that, you know, is true to um, some extent. But I always wanted to come in on my own. I'm on my own two feet, stand out, because that's the things I've been doing on my life, so, you know, it's just overtime grind, like, so I'm putting out two and three freestyles randomly, just giving niggas balls all day, um, and at the same time, just dropping new material, and, uh, right after this project, I got some extra, extra special, right after some of the games, so we just gonna keep working, and that's my mentality. A lot of the venues that we're doing on the Summer Games tour um, is real like intimate, you know what I'm saying? You really get to the, the, the feel the people, touch the people, you know what I'm saying? And give love back to, you know, your fans and then making new fans at the same time. Um, so, you know, we started out in New York, that's hometown. A lot of people came out and showed love. Then uh, we did Long Island. You know, first time I actually performed in Long Island, we did Rhode Island. Hampshire, Jersey, NC, DC, um, Virginia, and just keeping it moving. We're trying to have more days in that as well. And it's not just a summertime thing, right? We're playing summer games all year round. Let it blow, it gets deep, like your heart needs stitches. And your thoughts keep drifting. Could you ever love it? Nobody else can tell my story because nobody else really walked in my shoes and did what I did. So I just keep it 100% real, and that's something different. A lot of people like to compare me to, uh, you know, like a lot of the greats, you know, like I hear a lot of yo, he reminds me of a name that's JV, like Rockwaller even said that, which blew my mind, you know what I'm saying, because he's a dude with Grammys and actually worked with Jay-Z and just said the same thing, and I don't take no offense to that because to me, like, that's like the illest compliment ever, so, you know, if you don't compare me, you don't compare me to the greats, you know, for it. I see myself, uh, Peter Rosenberg actually hosted the show in Long Island, and we was just like on the sidelines, just having a long talk, and um, we 
just like, yo, man, like, it's time for you to really, really do your thing. Like, it's time. Like, you know, everybody loves you. You know, everybody loves your music. It's like, you know, why are you not there yet? He's like, look in the mirror, you know what I'm saying? And really, really tell yourself, this is your time. You can't play no more. You know what I'm saying? It's time to go. And it's like, it really touched me because, you know, it's just my, my man, somebody who believes in me, somebody who don't have to mess with me, you know, he's making his money, he's living in his ill breath, and he's like, you know, coming all the way out to Long Island, you know, to, to come mess with me and show me support, and that really shows me a lot. You know, it's just all about grinding and going hard and, uh, you know, really, really getting to that mainstream success. I don't want to be MC Underground forever. Like, that's not why I came there. Um, yeah, like, I'm going to go down the list. It's L.I.G. That's been great group. Um, I recently started doing some with Creative Recreation. Um, and it's a lot of other people that, that deal with me, but as far as, like, showing love, like, as far as cutting checks, yeah, those, those are the dudes that really help me out. And, you know, they... Like as far as like when you're doing this indie thing, a lot of people don't understand that it takes bread to do all of that. You know what I mean? And all. Um, like, you know, these companies, they believe in me enough to invest in shooting a video for me, to invest in, you know, sending me to Europe, you know, just to live and do shows and, and shoot videos and things like that. So I just been blessed, man. And like I said, like all of this stuff ain't happening for a reason. So, you know, they'll see it pretty soon. I'm actually, after I come off this tour, um, I'm gonna go link up with Travis McCoy and me and him, we doing a whole mixtape together. So that's gonna be special. We already two songs in. And um, that joint is called Gypsy Cat Confession for Early Summer Games. That's what we on, baby.